Jim, successful season for the Football Development Scholarship. Tell us exactly what's just happened. Um, basically, um, we've won the EFL, the inaugural, you know, the first season of the EFL uh, Northwest Division One League, um, which is a fantastic achievement. It's our seventh trophy in five seasons since we've started it, so it's something that we're used to doing. Um, however, obviously, the, the groups of lads change, and uh, it's just fantastic for I think you know local football that these lads are getting an opportunity to you know get a taste and a feel for what it's like to train like a professional footballer but obviously they get the most importantly they get the education at the same time Henry just won the title you must be quite proud about that yeah I thought we deserved it 100% uh, came off a shaky start to the start of the season losing the first game but I thought we bounced back brilliant uh, full teams great bunch of lads to play with uh, uh, it's just brilliant really what stage of the season did you lads start to realise you were in with the shout of actually winning this division well we've always thought from the start of the season that we've had a good chance but near the end I thought it's like it's coming here I thought we could bring it home so how proud is it for you to captain a Carl outside that's done something like this oh it's brilliant isn't it <laughs> I don't know what much to say great bunch of lads and it's just brilliant <laughs> for lads out there your age a little bit younger who don't know much about this course Henry is it something that you'd recommend oh definitely like balancing the football and the work it's like it's a great mixture and as long as you get work done and like do the best of your ability then football's brilliant to play on the side it's a great addition what sort of clubs are they up against we play Manchester City uh, Shrewsbury Town Blackburn Rovers Fleetwood Town Morecambe um, Blackpool, so Northwest region. Um, we, the, there's a national cup, cup competition as well. Unfortunately, we got beat in the semi finals against Birmingham City, which we actually played here at Brunton Park, which was fantastic for the lads. So, yeah, you come up with it. it it's a mixed bag. Some of these teams have been going for a while with the 11 aside. Some, some clubs have just started it. So, I can only say, you know, with uh, year on year, the sort of standard getting stronger, which means, you know, which, which is good because. Um, from a competitive point of view, if you know you're going into, you know, a real tough game every single, you know, time as a match, I think uh, it only enhances the lads' education when it comes to, to football and real football, and it gets them, you know, ready to take the next step, whether that's non-league or, you know, hopefully one day you never know one might push into, you know, back into the professional ranks where some of them have, have came from. I remember speaking to you a number of years ago where you went into this wide-eyed. Is it where you would want it to be? Is it where you expect it to be now? I think definitely. I think when you first start something, you're not sure how it's going to go. Um, obviously, it's been successful. It helps that you're successful educationally because you want you know, parents in the local area to think that their, their son's going into a good educational environment and a good place to go. That was massively important. But also, I think from a football point of view, if you can progress them that way as well, you know, it's a win-win, and um, I think once we've got the basics in place and the foundation, year on year we'll try and improve it. Whether that's on the media side, recording the the games and showing the analysis to the to the lads on where they've gone wrong or where they could do better and stuff like that, you know, or whether it's just improving our our teaching techniques, you know, uh, in the classroom. So I think every year, as long as we try and improve, try and get better, I think, you know, um, it'll continue to be successful.